Okay, my dear students, uh, today I would like to discuss one problem uh, for only, especially for medical students, uh, where they can solve the problems by using these integrations and differentiations which is shown in this problem. And this is a traditional method. Uh, let me solve the problem without integration also. We can do this problem, especially for students who are not aware of integration. So you can just see here. Uh, if you observe in this problem, it is given that y is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1. See here, uh, for example, if y is equal to 0, you all know that f is equal to 20 plus 10y. So if y is equal to 0, f1 will become 20 plus 10 into 0 is 10 here. So we will be getting f1 as 20 here. Next, if uh, y is equal to 1 according to the condition here, then you will be getting f2 is equal to 20 plus 10 into 1 is 10 that is f2 is going to be 30 here okay so now you can find out the average of these two forces that is f average is equal to f1 plus f2 by 2 therefore f average is nothing but 20 plus 30 by 2 which is nothing but 25 newtons so we got the force but how are you going to find out the work done here he's asking us to find out the work done that's it so work done w is nothing but force into displacement and you know that displacement is 0 to 1, that means 1 meter is the displacement here. Therefore, 25 into 1 is nothing but 25 joules. So this is a method which can be solved, which can be used to solve the problems when for by busy students, when they are not aware of integration and differentiation. Thank you if you like this method. Have a nice day.